Hello and welcome everyone. Today we are playing Conqueror's Blade. I have created a new character. I'm wielding a musket and so far I had a good time trying it out. This will be the first match that I will upload and yeah what I learned so far you can grab these cannons and you can destroy those siege towers. So if you succeed in destroying oh yeah if you succeed in destroying a siege tower they lose the progress of the distance they have traveled so far. If you destroy them when they are very close, of course that is very powerful because they will have to... Okay, and my cannon is gone. Well, if you succeed in destroying their, cannon, uh, their siege tower, they will have... Uh, it will respawn after 10 seconds and you can... Uh, and they can transport it all the way back. So, we'll try to focus those siege towers before all these cannons are being destroyed. E yeah. Okay. Well, there's one cannon to my right that is being... Can I just... No, I cannot use it. This guy is holding this cannon, but uh, he's not... He's not really shooting at it. And I've bought... Yeah, you can buy those siege... Oh, they already came up here. Yeah. You can buy siege equipment and then place it somewhere on the battlefield, but they're not really for attacking those siege towers. They're rather for attacking enemy units and heroes. So, as I understood it, this works by 10 or 10. Oh my god, where did she come from? Holy hell. And we're outnumbered. Two people next to me, my abilities are on cooldown. And yeah, we get support. Nice. Um, oh god, I'm gonna run. Yeah, I assisted on killing that guy. And now we are three versus one. So, uh, okay. Um, yeah, if anybody of you has ever played something like Samurai Warriors. Oh, oh god. And another guy. Let's burn him. And then we shoot him. And then, the, yeah, the shotgun shot. And there we go. Whew, I'm almost dead. Uh, you can heal every 60 seconds. Or you can heal all the time and you have a 60 second cooldown. And it heals like 60% yeah, of your health. Or at least 50, I'm not sure. And then you're good to go. Back into action. Yeah. Enemies can come with a battering ram. Siege towers and ladders in this game, and uh, short ranged muskets. Yeah, everything's out of range, but my fire bomb can still. Oh boy, what a Kobe! Ha! <laughs> yeah, there we go. <clears throat> so apparently, all the enemy units are going this way. Maybe we can see if we are able to help our allies on this side of the wall um, yeah they're pushing on both sides of the wall at the moment and I'm going to fully heal before I go back into action yeah and as you can see there's many units unfortunately I'm all out of units right now so and I didn't want to waste them at the start of the round. Now their units are coming up and we burn them. There's a little nice AOE firebomb that you can throw when you play the musket uh, hero class. I don't know how to call it. There's I think 10 classes and depending on what weapon you choose you have a, you have different abilities and I think they also come with a like an ultimate ability. Yeah, I think we should get back and have some cover of these guys. Oh no, I think those are allies. Yeah, those are allies. Yeah, definitely allies. Um, enemies have this little red dot above their head. But I'm almost going blind, I think. Okay, maybe if I stay up here, should be able to help. Okay, nobody else to fight at the moment. Wait, can I throw something down there? Uh, I don't see my... Yeah, okay, that... I don't know where that got stuck. Yeah. Okay, there's an enemy that has pushed through. 
Let's see if we can fend him off on the way. No, he's turning around. You can see him on the little mini-map. Cool thing is, the musket can be reloaded while you're riding the horse. When you're standing, you can only reload while, I believe, while walking, but not while sprinting. And very often when you're in combat, you want to sprint away because all those melee units will slice you into pieces. And this guy is on disadvantage right now. And I enjoy that. Let's give this guy a few more shots. I think he's going to die here sometime soon, I hope. I mean, we should be faster catching up. And I don't think he wants to lose his horse. Yeah. The horses can die, and when your horse dies, then you either need to go to a supply point and change it for a new horse, if you have any, um, that you have equipped pre-battle. Or you will have no horse until the end of the round, or even until the end of the game. Yeah. I'm going to leave my horse so it will not die. And, yeah. Enemy units coming down here. Oh boy. Headshot, headshot, headshot. The shotgun shot. The my Q is pretty strong, I think. One of my strongest abilities. Close range, of course. And the R is... The R ability, this firebomb... Is very nice, very nice. Okay, there's many units up here. Not so many allies. And the spot on the wall, point A, is taken. So we're going back to try and defend our home base. Uh, this is the closed beta test. Or you can have access to this game at the moment. Oh, oh I should not have come here. I should Fuck. Okay, yeah, that was quick. Apparently, running into a horde of enemies is not a good strategy for a ranged unit. Yeah, I could have known that, I'm sorry. Upon seeing the trailers, I pre-ordered this game and I do not regret. You can get access for 15 euro. And now we can choose a unit. My, my horse is dead and we can also choose this... Scorpio Siege weapon. And I'll just order them to attack here. Just get in there, guys. Protect me. Die for your lord! Oh yeah. And... I have sword and shield units. So they should be quite well defended. Yeah. And you can order this... Yeah, I just ordered a shield rush. Which is now on a 25 second cooldown, as you can see. And maybe this is the right moment to build a Scorpio here. Ah, no. It's probably... They are so close to us, and I believe they're all dead almost. Yeah. But there's more enemies over there. Oh, I killed somebody. Great. Okay, fuck it. Let's just build the Scorpio. And we will be able to defend this position quite well. Whenever anybody comes in here. And nobody comes in. Okay, one guy. What is he trying to do? Is he baiting us? Okay, yeah. Yeah, definitely baiting us. Oh god, oh god, guys, protect me. Guys, no! Oh god, he's, he's attacking my Scorpio already. I didn't get any use out of it. Nice one. Assisted, and now all the enemies are coming from behind me. Well, we still got a shot off there. And... Burn them. Yeah, hope... Guys, can, can I have my Scorpio? Yeah, great. Killed. Nice. Another kill. That is really satisfying. Okay, this horseman just... Fuck you. Seriously. He just killed my... Oh, he killed another guy with a headshot. Ha! Huh? Oh, boy. Yeah, this, this game is so... Okay, let's help over here. Apparently, this is where the action is happening. Yeah. One shot. 
one shot. And okay, he's running off. Well, let's go for these guys. Throw them. Oh yeah. To be honest, the best part of the of this firebomb is really just all those numbers popping up when you hit them. <laughs> when you hit like in a large group of enemies and they all catch fire. Headshot, headshot. Okay, those peop uh, those units are fleeing from battlefield, they're retreating. And that happens when you kill their the hero that they belong to. So apparently they just lost one of their heroes. And yeah, and this guy just lost his horse and now he's flying in the air. Yeah, I would also get really mad when someone kills my horse. <laughs> he's <laughs> Okay, don't forget guys, this is still early access. This is not even closed beta. This is just an open test. And oh, I'm almost dead. Okay. So, I will hide behind all these troops now. Yeah, you guys are fighting. Don't mind me over here. Oh god, guys, protect me! Oh my god! Um, yeah, I think... Now I should get my units eventually. Well, they're... Okay, they're still holding the other side. Do not neglect any of the sides. They, there's two sides they can push through. Basically. And yeah, I I really enjoy the musketeer class so far. You're you have a quite big damage potential, and you never feel like oh I cannot do anything because you can always shoot from range. Probably it's the same. Oh boy, oh yeah, that firebomb. Also, enemies who run through that firebomb get a little dot damage over time and. When you hit them with the firebomb, there's a little explosion that interrupts them from what they're doing in that second. And yeah, now we're going to heal in a safe distance from the enemies. Because when you get hit while healing, uh, you stop healing, unfortunately. Okay, we have one minute left. Oh, hello. Yeah, thanks for coming in. Like a free kill. Awesome. Yeah, you can also have a really good time with the Musketeer class in general. 32 seconds, assists, assists, and a lot of damage on enemy units with your hero. There's hero on hero damage, hero on unit damage, unit on hero damage, and unit on unit damage. So, for a good unit on unit damage, you need to be pretty good with the strategies. And, you know, you need to know what what units are playing with. Okay, yeah. And I'm not good with that. Anyway. We won that battle. Headshot. Battle is over. Victory. What? What do I see there? I'm even MVP? I started playing today. I've, I barely have a clue what I'm doing. Awesome. How, how, how come I'm MVP? There's other people having more kills. Just the guy below me. How? Okay, I assisted on eight kills then. And what what did the next guy do? Okay, and my units also killed three heroes. And the next guy. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I'm, I'll take it. I'm very happy. What a good game, man. So I'm going to cover more of this game I really enjoy it and it fills the gap that Total War Arena left behind I hope you people will enjoy the game if you want to try this game out um, the day I'm uploading this game is pro I think the last day where you can pre-order the game and get access to the game if you see this video anytime soon and you have fast internet I wish you good luck, and if not, then I'm going to upload a few more videos of footage that I'm going to get in the meantime. See you then, and thanks for watching.